That was gnarly. I'm scared. I don't want to move. What should I do? Don't go forward. Yeah, I'm, I'm trying not to. Hey y'all, it's me Savannah and it's time for the next vlog. Hey Mike. Hey Savannah. What you doing? We're doing a vlog. We here at Gatorland are professionals. Some of us. We here at Gatorland are professionals <laughs> who spend day in and day out working with real live jaw smashing carnivorous alligators and crocodiles. Now to most people, these incredibly powerful dinosaurs are among the most intimidating animals on the planet, but to us, they're our co-workers. We love them. We spend time with them every day. We worry about their well-being. But they don't worry about ours, do they? Stop it, Mike. I'm trying to set a tone here. Just saying. I'm just saying, stop interrupting. Fine, go. I've been reading through your comments, and I reply to most everyone I can, but I've been noticing a bit of a trend here. Y'all are getting used to seeing animals that really are friendly, like Blackwater, Daytona, Dundee. No, and not, not that one. Yes, Dundee's Dundee loves nice. us. No. Yes, he is. Anyways, and Pops, who enjoy their interactions with humans. But these guys are the exception to the rule, not the rule. Most alligators and crocodiles aren't so social with humans. In fact, there are a few residents here at Gatorland that aren't quite friendly at all. What are you talking about? There's one place at Gatorland that draws a chill down your spine. I feel it right now. What? What are you talking to them about? Even the bravest of the brave here at Gatorland dare to go into Savannah, this place. We're not, what? We're not doing that. Stop being, you're not being professional. You're trying to get us killed. We're not going there today. It's past the trail of teeth, over the passage of pain, just I'm, to the left of the butterfly garden of no. doom. I'm getting shivers just thinking about yeah. it. Hold on. We gotta it's stop. the shore of shadows. We don't have enough people. We can get more people. Cut. We gotta start over. I'm not no, doing we're not today. starting over. We're doing uh, it. We're going there today. You guys are gonna love it. Here we go to the shore. I need more of people. Shadows. Then get more people. So it's a really, really long walk, and then a drive as well to get to the shores of shadow. Long walk. Like, do we have to walk it? Can we get like a little gator cart or something? No, we gotta walk, then we gotta climb, then we gotta ride in the ladybug. Tell them about the ladybug. Okay, so the ladybug <laughs> is, it's like an off-road vehicle. We need it to get to where we're going. But the thing with the ladybug is, is it's bright red. So all the alligators know when the big bright red ladybug comes, it's time to eat. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the ladybug. It is bright red color. And thank you so much, Mo, for being our spokes model. Did you know that alligators and crocodiles can see color? So they can tell the difference between this vehicle and any other vehicle. Thank you so much, Mo. So when we get there, it's gonna be crazy. Hopefully we can sneak in, maybe the ladybug's you know, running low on gas and it's kind of quiet today, so cross your fingers. It's not gonna be easy. Young alligators are a lot more spry than older alligators. They like to jump around, they like to spin around. Well, they also warm up faster and yeah. they, they, they cool down quicker, so now it's kind of hot, so they're ready to go today. They're, they're gonna be pretty angry. Why are you not talking, Mike? I gotta look where I'm going. I'm back here in the four-wheel <laughs> capital of the world. Mike, Mike, go that way. Cut right. Oh, he's got us taking some off road. Oh, yeah. Trail. Cut right, stay along the fence. This is called the Trail of Teeth. The Trail of Teeth? It's the called the Trails of Stickers. The Treacherous Trail what of Teeth. What are you teeth. talking about? Four-wheel drive. You know, Gatorland is 110 acres of alligators and wildlife. Ow! Here's Watch where we're out. driving. Let me turn the camera. This is not on the park map. No, uh -huh. this is way beyond on the park map. And Michael, lift that piece of uh, branch up. <laughs> there you go, that's good. Now drop it right when I get my feet. All right, cool. <laughs> got him. I, I think I got him good. This time I'm sitting in the front. He didn't got no head on. I dropped that one. That was a heavy one. How's the ride back there? Is, you know, I, 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 I'm upset that I recommended this route. There's got to be an easier way to get there. There is, but this is the backside of it. Uh-oh. 
Everybody duck! Oh, Everybody duck! Ah! <laughs> you right. did it! Usually when we do videos, we don't need a team of five people to go do the video. But when we go into the shores of Shadow, we need a lot of people. Everyone looking, everyone on guard. It's very, very, very much terrifying down here. Well, there's and, a lot of alligators and they can come up from just about <laughs> anywhere. And these alligators, we don't work with these alligators on a regular basis. They're just basically out here hanging out, eating, breeding, doing whatever alligators do when people aren't around until today. Mike, do you want to say anything? I don't want to be down here. Well, maybe we don't want you down here anyways. I mean, these guys are crazy down here, and we're just standing in here, just like this is this filming. Is, this is part of the deal, though. Yeah, you just gotta wait. Yeah. Until okay. something awesome. Happens. Is there any way we can get Kimmy in here to throw meat at Mike again? Can we yeah, do that? Yeah. Yeah. I need to talk to you about yeah. that. <laughs> we call it the Shores of Shadow because there's a lot of shadows back here, and if you've watched a lot of our vlogs, you know that alligators and crocodiles like to hide in the shadows. They're in the trees. No, they're not in the trees right now. Oh, there was an alligator. There's a bird nest. Sometimes I don't like coming back here because it's too scary. And I don't know where everything is back here. That's why I brought all the people. Sometimes you get stuck on vines and things like that when you're back here. I like you. Don't bite me. Don't, don't. Don't bite us! Watch out for that one. I got him! You can see them growling. Hey! You beat them. <laughs> I was trying, but they came around my defenses. I'm trying to stay away. Let's go! Let's go! Let's go! Here, I'll hold the shield. You hold my shield. Woo! Look out! That looks crazy. Let's go! He's about to get surrounded. Here, listen. Hey, throw some food at his feet. Where'd you get that idea, Mike? <laughs> I'm gonna give it to my daughter. <laughs> what are you doing, Pete? Getting them to crawl upon the roots of wisdom that are right here, the tree of terror. Okay. Donnie, are you all right? I'm all right. The problem is we got to go that way. I know. All right, I'm going to see if I can sneak Whoa! behind Whoa! Right behind Careful, you. Donnie. Oh, oh, my gosh. Okay. Now it's your turn. No, I, I, I'm going to stay right here. Oh, you move out of the way for her. Don't come after me. <laughs> run, Donnie, run. Run, uh -huh. Donnie, run. Okay. Woo -hoo! Okay, the on. alligator is going to get you. This way. <laughs> I'm gonna try to jump past. Ready? Yeah, you're not gonna make it. <laughs> ah, Donnie! Oh. <laughs> we need to talk about hazard pay. Where's everybody else at, Donnie? They left us. Why do they do stuff like that? They're over there feeding them. I ran to an ant pile. <laughs> this is crazy. All right, I'm coming back. Okay. Quiet. Maybe if I go slow. Yeah, go slow and quiet. <laughs> How are we gonna get out of here? I don't know, you're tall, can I piggyback? <laughs> Donnie. Yeah. Where are we going now? We're going in with Chester, the big one. Biggest in the park if you're on my team, all right? Oh, what? Yeah, now Chester is a little cranky like always, but we're gonna go in and see what he's doing. Donnie, you look so teeny over there. I know, I feel <laughs> teeny next to Chester, so uh, if you guys don't know Chester, he is one of the largest alligators that we have at the park. A big, one of the biggest ones we've actually measured. Uh, and Chester is a rescued alligator. So, uh, please don't do it. 
Don't do it. I'm trying to read all the signs here. He's starting to plant his back feet and get ready. Uh, just because, you know, we're in here, Chester's thinking we're in here to feed him. So we're in here to kind of show you guys how big they can get, how much power they have. Uh, and Chester being a rescued alligator, he's got a little bit of an attitude uh, because, you know, he comes from a different setting than the rest of the gators here at Gatorland. All right, so what we're going to try to show you guys is just how strong and powerful alligators' jaws are. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to get Chester to just slam his mouth shut and see if you guys can hear that and feel that through the video. So let's see if we can do that. I want you guys to take a look uh, behind Chester's mouth. You'll see. All right, all right, all right. I come in peace, I come in peace. If you look at his neck area, alligators have what we call jowls. And that big floppy stuff at the back of their jaw, believe it or not, is all their jaw muscle, which gives them one of the strongest bites and one of the most intimidating bite pressures on the earth. So let's see if we can get him to, to shut his mouth for you guys one time. Whoop. Ready? Careful, Donnie. Ready? Give him a little tickle. Oh, okay. Ooh. There it is. Now, like we talked about before, alligators have one of the strongest bite forces on the face of the planet. Uh, and that's because they need it. They need that strength to be able to hold on to animals that they jump up and grab. Everybody check your fingers. I got mine. Donnie, check your underwear. I'm scared. I'm still scared. <laughs> right, I'm sorry. I missed that. Too close. <laughs> All right, guys, well, I hope you liked this vlog, and I hope you learned a little something along the way. Did you guys learn anything? Yeah, I learned not to go trucking through the woods where there's alligators around. All right, so and yeah. what did you learn, Pete? Uh, I learned about the Tree of Wisdom. <laughs> <laughs> what did you learn, Michael? Uh, that those gators are not very sane. <laughs> Mike, did you learn anything? Yeah, I learned that we had a Tree of Wisdom. I learned that we work great together as a team because everybody's got their fingers. That's what I learned. All right, guys, so check that like button. Smash the notification bell. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel. Tell your friends to, too. Look at Mike learning about you, too. Yeah. Oh, yeah. so good. He gave the he's got to stop that Wawa three times. Has he really? Yes. Yeah. And that's how Superstar he's boss over here. <laughs> Superstar. We love you guys. Bye. Yeah.